Welcome to Chopstick Travel, I'm Luke Martin and today is day two of our series here in Canada. So we've come to Vancouver Island today. This place is so famous for its beautiful nature. This is our first time here. So today we're gonna be exploring the island, doing a little bit of hiking, visiting the popular surf town of Tofino and sampling some of Vancouver Island's street food. It's gonna be a great episode, so make sure you stay tuned until the end. But first, I'm gonna cook us up a true Canadian breakfast to start our day. Let's go. So we've cooked ourselves up a great Canadian breakfast today. We've got the classic typical plate starting with the pancakes and of course we've got to have some grade A Canadian 100% pure maple syrup. We've also got the maple bacon, some sunny side up eggs, a couple raspberries and then some toast but I gotta dig into the pancakes. These are my favorite. A lot of people go for the savory breakfast. I'm all about the sweet breakfast and let's get raspberry on top there too. Try that. Mm. That's just like childhood. That's just an instant pancake mix. It's really cakey, but it soaks up all of that maple syrup, which is so naturally sweet and delicious. And you gotta chase it with a little bit of Canadian bacon, also maple bacon. Mm. This is my kind of morning. And it's beautiful out here. Best way to eat the eggs, just throw them on top of the toast, break the yolk like that. Oh man. How's breakfast? Breakfast is really good, but unfortunately it's a little cold because it took us so long to cook and also it's really cold outside, so what can you do, right? This Airbnb we rented has an incredible view over the Somas River. We're here in Port Alberni on Vancouver Island. Apparently there's some bears that hang out down here, but we haven't seen them yet. There's just one more thing we need for breakfast today and that's coffee. Thank you. So like I said, this is our first time to Vancouver Island. It's known for having an abundance of wildlife and nature. We've actually got some binoculars and uh, we've been checking out the river all morning. Serena claims that she saw an otter. I did. I think we'll take a walk down to the river after we're done with our coffee and check it out a little closer. Okay, we just spotted something. Sea lions. Wait. I got it. Wait. Let's go. So we took a walk down to the river, not really expecting to see anything. If anything, we thought we were gonna see a bear just because there's so many signs of uh, beware of bears around this area. But then we look out and there's these sea lions in the river. I've never seen a sea lion and I didn't expect to see it in the river. I think I got a shot of them grabbing the fish and the seagulls going crazy and they're just throwing the fish around and popping out of the water. 
that was incredible and that's just like a two second walk down from our Airbnb so I'm excited to see what else we get up to today. Okay what an amazing start to this day. I can't believe we saw what we just saw but let's head over now to Tofino. This is the most incredible drive I think I've ever done. The roads are like butter. There's nobody out here. The trees are just starting to change and it is absolutely gorgeous. Oh, what did you get in the head? We are on our way to Tofino, but on the way we had to stop at Taylor Arm Provincial Park. This place is absolutely beautiful and I think we're probably going to be making a lot of pit stops along the way because this nature and this beauty is just incredible. What happened? Shit! I, <laughs> I stepped on this guy by accident and I slipped on him. What is he? He's a big... Slug. Oh. I think he's okay, actually. Okay, let's keep going. Because of the climate here on Vancouver Island, it's not like anywhere else in Canada. Whereas usually you would think of a boreal forest, here we have these lush, lush rainforests. I've truly never seen anything like this in Canada. This is our first time in Vancouver Island. It is beautiful. <laughs> Here at Taylor Arm Provincial Park, you can come down to the lake. This is called Sprout Lake. It's this massive lake and the water is so crystal clear and clean. It was supposed to rain today, but the sun is out. If I hadn't known, I probably would have brought my bathing suit because I really want to jump in the water now. But for real, let's go to Tofino this time and we'll pick back up with you on the Pacific coast. We've made it to beautiful Tofino, British Columbia. This is the surf capital of Canada. And we've come down to the beach, but we are so hungry. We're gonna keep going, get something to eat, then come back to the beach, explore a little bit more. Let's go get some tacos. Look at this, this is one big piece of kelp. Whoa. Pick it up. This thing's like a snake. Yeah, it's heavy. Ooh. Popular spot, isn't it? Yes, yeah, super popular. I don't know how long we're gonna be waiting. What yeah, do you think? I don't know. 30 minutes at least. 30 minutes, maybe an hour. Um, and bean? Yep. Yeah. Okay. 
So the stall is super cool. It's in this like little van that they've kind of permanently set up here and covered in stickers. And everyone just waits around the parking lot for their name to get called. We ordered up a bunch of different tacos. I'm really excited, I'm super hungry. So while we wait, I've got ourselves a smoothie. I've got the watermelon with basil and they call these freshies. Let me try it out. Mm. Oh wow. The watermelon's sweet, the basil has a nice kind of floral taste to it. It actually works really good together. I've never had a basil with watermelon smoothie. Just waiting for our food. Mm. I also got a freshie and this is the lime mint, so let's give that one a try. A little stir. Ooh. Yep, that's real lime, real mint. That's nice. Hey. Yeah, thanks. Thank you. We've got our first two tacos here. These are both fish tacos. This one's tuna, this one's fish. I think this is fried fish. And these are just so colorful and beautiful. A little bit of lime on top. And this here is the tuna one. It looks like they've got a little bit of uh, pickled ginger on top and then a nice crispy tortilla. And then that actually might be a little bit of uh, seaweed and then there's some pieces of tune underneath. Oh, man. Wow. It's not like a hard shell taco. It doesn't completely crumble when you bite into it. And probably the best ingredient in here, apart from the tuna, is that pickled ginger. Mm. So this one right here is the beef taco. It's got these pickled onions, some carrots, this mystery white sauce, it's probably mayo, um, cilantro, and then beef underneath. I'm going to drizzle the lime on, that gives it a nice kick. So this one's all about the textures. Everything inside is crunchy. The pickled onions, the carrots, even the cilantro has a nice fresh crisp and the tortilla as well. And that beef is just kind of smoky. So it's just a really great combination. I love it. This one is the fried fish taco. A Little bit of salsa on top again, a little bit of lime. And it looks like quite a bit of shredded cabbage as well. And I'm just leaning up against the car here. This is a really chill spot we're just kind of in a parking lot but it really fits the vibe of tofino with all the surfers <laughs> those are killer this is a vegetarian option this is the black bean taco so what do they have is the black beans on the bottom a little bit of a mayo i think as well a salsa with tomatoes um, cilantro again and feta cheese and of course gotta drizzle that lime on top they also have a vegan option but this is just the vegetarian mm. it's got uh, that burrito vibe going on look at that inside so if you're a lover of the Taiwanese spring rolls that are jam-packed full of cilantro you're gonna love this and speaking of Taiwan we have our merch for sale, the Taiwan design, the durian design, and the tuna nigiri. It's available right now. The link will be down in the description. Those are some really good tacos. What was the best one? Definitely the tuna, hands down. Yeah, I also vote for the tuna. Also, the fish taco is really good. Yeah. And I really like how light and refreshing they were. It wasn't just stuffed with cheese and sauce and meat. It felt very uh, fresh yeah. and healthy. And I definitely recommend stopping at Taco Fino when you're in Tofino. And you should definitely come to Tofino because it's so beautiful. But we're going to head back to that beach. We didn't get to check it out quite enough. So let's yeah. go back to the beach now.
are back and we are at Chesterman Beach. So this is right next to Tofino, right next to Tagofino. It's getting a little late in the day, but it is absolutely gorgeous here. It is misty, it's so windy, and the waves are huge. We have tons of people here surfing, people walking their dogs, uh, just walking along the water. It's absolutely beautiful. I would say definitely check it out. It's free to come in. You just park right outside and then come on down to the beach. Um, this is our last stop uh, near the Pacific Rim National Park for the day before we head back to Port Alberni. Uh, but we just had a lovely trip out here. It's gorgeous. Food's good. We've been eating well all day and just really enjoying our time. Check it out. We just got back to Port Alberni and we were gonna come check out this really cool drive-in burger shop, but they're closed. Damn it. So we didn't get a cheeseburger, but we've got a very traditional Canadian dinner coming on. This the is what I grew stove. up on. What are you cooking, Sabrina? We're having spaghetti, so. <laughs> <laughs> Looks good. Yeah. I've also right. made some asparagus. I'm hungry. Looks good. It's going to be ready in a couple minutes. How is it? It's good. Sabrina makes a mean sketty. Oh, yeah. Ooh, that hit the spot. Thank you for dinner. Welcome. Guys, make sure you try to come to Vancouver Island once in your life. It's got to be one of the most pristine places I've ever visited. And Taco Fino, definitely try it out if you're in Tofino because that was also some delicious tacos. Yeah. Make sure to subscribe if you haven't already. Hit the bell icon so you're notified when we post our next episode. And we'll see you next time. Chopstick Travel. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.